Mabuhai and welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking not about food but maybe about another topic that is close to it. So today's topic will be alcohol. So today only adults only. This video is for 18 years and above. You have to be in the drinking age. So come on and I let you get into my secret chamber. So here we are, today's topic, Tajir Gin, Southeast Asian's finest, at least a little bit Pinoy influenced, so that's what I heard. Because in my research on the internet, I saw a video by Commander Daot that he was visiting the distillery in Great Britain and I thought, hey, that's a nice idea, I want to make a follow up and uh, I want to know what is it really about. We have the drinks here. We have a bucket full of ice and we want to know is it really what they promised it would be. They won a prize 2020 in the IWSC awards for this gin Tajir, the normal uh, Asian dry gin they got a bronze medal and for the brother or sister gin uh, they even got a gold medal. My favorite gin I normally drink it is the Monkey 47 from the Black Forest. So we want to test what can they do because Monkey 47, they got a gold medal in the IWSC already 2011 and since then they won a lot of awards. Gin is not gin. There is so many things you can make in a different way and it stands, it falls with the tonic water. For me this time it was not so easy because uh, the tonic water they were implementing for the Tajir gin is artisan and we don't have that normally here in Germany. So I went a little bit on research in the internet and I ordered a little bit here and I ordered a little bit there. So we got our supplies to make it right. With the Monkey 47 it's easy, we use just the Thomas Henry. I think you get it everywhere in the world. Let's open it up. Sweet. So, here we go, my child. Cheers. Yeah. The main ingredients, what they say in this gin, is uh, the calamansi. Uh, the Thai sweet basil and different kind of peppers and you can really tell a little bit of the pepper even and uh, it's nice that we're drying it just clear I know normally in the gin you can put a lot of different stuff in the glass you could put calamansi in the glass just to make the flavors a little bit more intense but like this it's not necessary it really comes out nice it's smooth and um, you don't have this alcohol feel of it. There is a lot of cheap gins where you really think like ah, that's just that's the sprit. No. This is really nice round. You can really enjoy this and the best of it we are drinking for the wealth of the Taj years because 10% of the profit they make with the gin, they will donate for saving the Tajirs in the Philippines. They are supporting different groups, so I can put a link underneath. And while drinking, we're doing something great, so let's enjoy a little bit. There you go, my chance. It's your turn. Oh my god. Let me try. Also, this is my favorite partner of this, Tarshir Gin. Um, it's lemon. It is a, you know, lemon tonic, no? So this is my favorite than the classic London tonic. And 
we have a taste. We have a free taste already with this before, so we're sharing it to you now. We just wanted to get drunk. <laughs> oh. Honestly, I started drinking when I was on board. I never been trying any drinks in my whole life since I was 25. <laughs> so when I was 25, I cut the border and I taste alcohol and so far I love gin. So this is my favorite so far. Normally we're drinking Monkey 47. Ooh, is it? There it is. Yes, this is our favorite with the Thomas um, Henry tonic. This is really best together. But since Mr. Commander Daot, we saw in his vlog that he tried this kind of gin. So we are curious about it, even if it's a little bit like price range like this. And that is the upper price range. Yes, and, uh, <laughs> we tried how how really um, how how really the taste brings together with this kind of tonic. So I could say, if you are a hard hard drinker, maybe uh, you go for the classic London tonic together with this. But if you're like me, that just loves sweet and you know, still with a little bit of alcohol in there, you go for this kind of tonic. They're really perfect together. So, yeah. I know my I know my father will get angry with me <laughs> because I'm drinking. Let us see that you're drinking. So let's <laughs> share it in the vlog that I am drinking. <laughs> he got now an evidence that I am drinking. Prost, Papa. So. Mm. Really, the calamansi is there. I really, sorry. The la, the calamansi. This tonic is really perfect for me in this gin, and the gin is really, I mean, perfect. It it really catches my taste for for a not really a drinker type person. This is really good, I would say. Now then, prost, my chat. Thank you, Tarshir, for making a nice dream. This is not a sponsored video. No, this is not. <laughs> uh, Jin loves gin, so. Jin loves gin, that's good. That's Yeah, that is really some kind of combination, I have to say. I really love the taste. I'm really impressed. I, I have to say, I, I didn't think that it would be that good. Me because too. me too. Yeah, she's, she's supporting me. That's not so often. <laughs> no, okay. Just making fun here. Um, yeah, like we said, normally I'm drinking... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, not the picture. Ooh. A monkey 47 that is by far really my my favorite gin you have to say um if you open it it's really it's like a like a big nice field in the black forest you can smell all the flowers and also it doesn't taste like alcohol this instant taste of the cheap gins they don't have it and also what i can tell about those gins in these combinations you're not having a problem in the morning because uh, if you're having bad combinations and cheap gins, cheap, cheap gins, okay, I have to look out already. La, 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 going for the tongue. Um, yeah, with the cheap gins, it is like it's nice in the evening, but it's really bad in the morning. I think I have to go for one more. While you're watching at the bottles, I'm already done. <laughs> if you want to know more, there's a lot of websites. You can learn about combinations where you get 
uh, tips what will fit with each other what you can put else in the glass like a little bit of cardamom or whatsoever to enhance the taste make your research gin is a big topic and i believe you can get a lot out of there if you're interested for us this is really just a personal um impression we wanted to share it with you because we saw it on other channels i saw that they made a price i saw that tajir is going doing good by donating money to save the tajirs in the philippines so we wanted to support that it's a non-sponsored video and uh, of course we wanted to have some fun so next round this time to my home the black forest complete different direction and we just had the calamansi and a little bit the strong taste with the peppers this is so sweet by itself it's so smooth that you really oh, i'm just melting away i have to say i'm so don't disturb me anymore i want to drink go <laughs> no we're just joking of course these are our opinions i will share some links in the bottom so that you can get more information and uh, yeah hope you enjoyed us drinking here a little bit we continue a little bit and uh, oh a little bit a little bit a little bit i'm already repeating myself Put together we're nearly at the end <laughs> yes um what i wanted to say i'm bought me more i'm bought i'm bought <laughs> oh my goodness no of course uh, yeah we continue <laughs> no others fine others good um yeah we're going to continue have some fun having a good night we wanted to share with you the, those informations and uh, yeah, hope you had fun with us and see you in the future. Cheers.